through and off, sometimes known as a chain gang. This is a key skill in road racing and one that will allow you to go much faster than you can on your own, if you learn how to do it properly. A line of riders will ride through and off at the front of a bunch to keep the group's pace consistent and high while staying safe. A pace line can be a dangerous place though, with riders in close proximity and two lines going at different speeds, usually with one common race objective. This may be to bring back a brake or to hold a pace that prevents brakes going away. Make sure that firstly you're confident in your own ability and secondly of those around you. Race smart. It's important to keep the pace steady. The idea is not to surge through for your turn at the front 5 k's per hour faster than anyone before you, just to show how strong you are. This will disrupt the flow of the group and ultimately lead to a slower average speed. Keep the two lines close together. When it comes to passing the rider falling back to do your turn on the front, keep close to their side. If you leave a big gap, there'll be a channel of air passing through the middle of the group which will slow everybody down. Keeping things close together will make things faster for everyone. Follow the wheel ahead closely without overlapping and look down the road past the front of the line. If you're dropping back or it's a single line, look over your shoulder as you drop back to see gaps coming up and communicate with other riders and listen out for riders talking to you. Keep your front wheel to the side of the person in front of you and when the last person draws alongside you, start to speed up. This will save you energy compared to if you wait until they've gone past completely. Keep yourself out of the wind and alter the direction of rotation accordingly. If the wind is coming from your right, then you should be rotating clockwise and anti-clockwise if the wind is blowing from the left. Regardless of wind direction, riders should always be on the correct side of the road. If you're the most experienced rider in the group, then take the initiative to change the direction of rotation if you go round a corner and the wind is coming from a different side. Communication is a key part of racing smart. Don't hit the pedals hard when you get to the front. The speed should remain the same and the person pulling off should slow down slightly. Smoother is always faster. Don't ride too hard on climbs if you're the strongest in the group. All this will serve to do is put your fellow riders into the red and then they'll not be able to contribute once the road flattens again. Good communication is key to riding through and off. Keep it tight, don't let gaps appear and encourage other riders in the line. Normal group etiquette remains. Point out and verbally alert the others in the group if you see any holes or other hazards coming up. If you simply cannot do another turn then it is okay to temporarily sit on the back to recover. But make sure that you alert the riders of what you're doing. Simply say hop so that they know that you're not coming through. Why is it called a chain gang? Well because one line effectively moves forward whilst the other line moves backwards. A little bit like a chain on a bike. The thrill of riding in a bunch is what many of us love about racing. It's an exciting place to be and if you race smart you can conserve energy which could help put you in the mix for the finale.